you heard the saying, let your food be your medicine, and your medicine be your food? But what if the meal turns harmful? You'll agree that eating well and exercising makes you feel good. But similarly, some meals might make you irritated and ruin your mood. In our video, let us take a look into 15 foods that put you in a bad mood. Let's dive right into it. Cereal Scans at number 15 on our list. Well, when life gives you lemon. Because of refining the original wheat, corn, or oat grain, most store bought cereals contain processed components and are rich in refined carbs. Eating refined carbs might trigger mood swings and cause an increased risk of depression by sending your blood sugar on a roller coaster. There are high chances for cereal to put you in a bad mood. So instead, have a protein and complex carbohydrate-rich breakfast, which will help balance your blood sugar and keep you energized and ready to face the day. Coffee comes next on our list. A damn fine cup of coffee. I am positive that most of us here can't even think of a life without our daily coffee, but it's hard to say that caffeine intake is a double-edged sword. Depending on how much coffee you drink, it can significantly impact your mood. When we drink coffee, our bodies create cortisol, the primary stress hormone. As a result, our energy levels rise, and our physical and mental functions become more active. When this surge comes crashing down, one can frequently feel weary with poor mental and physical energy. It can lead to more chronic problems including adrenal fatigue, mood swings, depression, anxiety, and bad moods overall. Next, processed foods hold the 13th position on our list. This is a tasty burger. We already know that processed foods contribute to weight gain since they often include high levels of refined sugars, saturated fats, preservatives, and various chemicals to make them shelf-stable and tasty for a long time. Unfortunately, these meals utterly disturb our mental and emotional functioning, leaving us feeling unhappy, weary, nervous, tired, unmotivated, and uninspired throughout the process. Remember that the next time you want to treat yourself to some biscuits. Number 12 is backed by canned food. Must have food. When going through canned food aisle, consider that sodium levels aren't the only things you can scan the product for. When you're buying canned food, make sure that the label says BPA-free, since this chemical ingredient has been linked to a variety of chronic mood problems, including melancholy and anxiety. Number 11 on our list is french fries. My first french fry in eight years. Unless the restaurant you're eating at bakes their own chips, which is rare, you'll be eating a handful of those delectable fries that are heavy in refined carbohydrates, saturated fats, and salt. It might harm your mood. Traditional fries contain refined carbohydrates, saturated fats, and salt, which induce an energy high when one feels fantastic and alert. A decrease leaves one feeling lethargic, irritated, tired, and foggy. Margarine stands at number 10 on our list. Margarine has a lot of processed, saturated fats, which aren't the same as the fat found in healthful foods like olive oil, almonds, and avocado. As a result, margarine intake can create blood sugar imbalances, resulting in mood changes and weight gain. Baked goods come next on our list. Cookie! Ah, oh, he wants a cookie! Oh, I love the muffins! Traditional baked goods such as cookies, muffins, cakes, and pies are high in refined sugars and saturated oils, making you feel overweight, sluggish, sad, and can give you mood swings. While desserts are the greatest treats, coming to terms with the fact that they can make you sad can be quite difficult to cope with. Salted peanuts hold the eighth position on your list. Happy Valentine's Day, SpongeBob! I'm nuts for you! Most diets should avoid salted peanuts. Most store-bought peanuts are heavy in salt and sometimes include a food ingredient called MSG. The artificial taste makes people feel melancholic, sluggish, exhausted, cranky, or have headaches and bad moods. Instead, make your own raw walnut, almond, and Brazil nut mixture. In addition, a new study suggests that rosemary may protect the brain, so mix your raw nuts with rosemary and a touch of sea salt before roasting at home. Number 7 is backed by Package and Process Seeds. What, what am I eating? What is this, bird, bird seed? While raw or roasted versions are delicious, 
Processed versions are sometimes coated in potassium bromate, a preservative that prevents iodine from being absorbed by the thyroid. You may not be able to operate normally if your thyroid is not functioning correctly. When dealing with depression, psychiatrists frequently monitor their patients' thyroid levels. Unfortunately, they're also high in salt and potentially harmful food additives. Number 6 on our list is cold cuts. High quantities of energy-sucking, mood-altering, nitrates, food preservatives, colorings, and chemicals in packaged meats like ham, bologna, hot dogs, and even turkey can induce mood swings, water retention, bloating, and headaches. Instead, roast your turkey or chicken breasts and slice them yourself for a healthier and less expensive option. Vegetable shortening stands at number 5 on our list. Vegetables? Vegetable shortening should be avoided since it contains inflammation promoting industrial fats and high quantities of omega-6 fatty acids, which can disrupt mood and insulin levels by blocking off brain building, mood enhancing omega-3 fatty acids. Instead, we may use olive oil or pasture butter from grass-fed cows, both of which have anti-cancer effects and have been demonstrated to reduce belly fat and heart attack risk. Agave nectar comes next on our list. Fructose is an excess in agave nectar. As a result, it raises your chances of developing metabolic syndrome, which puts you at risk for brain shrinkage and mood swings. While all sweets should be used in moderation, instead of agave, try using 100% maple syrup or local honey, including essential minerals and plant antioxidants that promote health. Bagels hold the third position in our list. Bagel simple carbohydrates will have you feeling all over the place since they spike blood sugar and cause it to fall. Bagels are constructed from white grains, which have little nutritional value and the blood sugar increase will be more pronounced if the bagel isn't eaten with protein. If you need a carb fix, look for healthy carbohydrates like sweet potatoes and steel-cut oats, both nutrient-dense and high in satiating fiber. Number 2 is backed by high sugar juices and cocktail mixers. Where's my cocktail? You may be making your cocktails at home, but fruit juices and cocktail mixers are often high in sugar. When it comes to sugar content, they're similar to soda drinks. The result of their high sugar content is the same. Sugars will be released into the bloodstream, causing an energy surge that will eventually fade away, leaving one tired, irritated, and melancholic. It can give you bad mood swings as well. Number 1 on our List is soda. A carbonated drink can put you in a bad mood. Unfortunately, people give so much for such a temporary fix. Simple sugars and soda drinks are easily absorbed into circulation. It creates an energy spike followed by a drop, affecting blood sugar management, energy levels, and mood. Diet beverages with zero calories are hazardous. And not just because of the cancer-causing aspartame. According to several studies, persons who consume at least two diet sodas per day are more prone to develop a soda belly, which protrudes out like a beer belly or even a pregnant belly. Foods affect our brain chemistry directly, but moods also impact food choices. So knowing what various foods do for you is vital for living a healthy lifestyle. Food guilt isn't the only thing that makes you grumpy when you indulge in your culinary vices, so think twice about the food choices on our list. Did you find our food list interesting? Let us know in our comments section. Before you leave, make sure to like our video if you are a newbie to our channel. Never miss to subscribe and hit the bell button. We will meet you in another video. Until then, bye!